I'd be like, girl, I'm so cool, 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 cool. Ain't nobody bad like me. Welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's doing well out there. I am going to try to keep these videos coming to you. If not daily, definitely just a few times per week. Here it is here and I have personalized it and decorated it and you may have seen it a couple of times. And I hope you don't get tired of it because you won't see her, but let me show you what I did. This is a Louis Vuitton um, inspired chain that I got from Amazon and then I went on and I added a little gold keychain and it actually glitters very nice it's so 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 pretty very very pretty and um, of course the original coach tag and it also has the little gold you know chain um, I always try to make sure I keep my things matching if my um, hardware is gold and I try to also match it up with gold items on the outside so that's what she looks like take a good look at that if you're interested uh, check it out this is the small size to this particular bag they did have one that comes up about here but at the time my purpose was trying to get something small for when I'm running out and about after I got it, it is roomy, but after I got it and I saw the other one in person, I realized it was not terribly too big to be a crossbody, so I could have gotten that one. So if I were to get it again, like I wanted the cream color one that comes like this. If I were to get it again, uh, I would definitely go up a size. Um, all right, well, let's jump into it. Here is the long strap. Uh, now, let me tell you, I do have this extended because I was doing another video showing you how to get um, more room if you are, you know, a larger or taller woman and you needed to wear a crossbody and it, it wasn't uh, long enough for you just hooking it from here to here. Uh, all I did, uh oh, sorry, I'm shaking it. All I did was add the top handle strap to the crossbody strap and that gave me more room so i'm going to go ahead and take that off for this video purpose so this is what it looks like if i was to carry it without this strap which i love and it does fit my arms which are um pretty good size there if you're wondering you know if you do have larger arms and stuff uh, that's just a FYI for you. And then I'm going to go ahead and connect it back. And I'm trying not to shake the table that I'm on so that, okay, so here you are. So even if you're carrying it like that on your shoulder, you can go ahead and let that drop to the bottom. And it's just, a, this is generally how I wear it, just like this. And then of course you can add another, like a different gold chain and take all these chains off all together. So you definitely can personalize your bag. Please don't wear this bag, just how they send it to you. I know maybe if you're, you know, in a professional setting, then you would definitely want to, I guess, I don't know. Cause some people, you could dress a, a, a work bag up too with some pearls and stuff. There's ways to still stand out and be professional. But anyway, let's get into the bag because I wanted it to be a video under 15 minutes. So what I'm gonna do is just slide this back and this is magnetic. So it actually helps keep this in place for me and not worry about it, you know, moving and all of that. But I'm gonna go ahead and slide it back just so that I can open this. And she is junky just how I was carrying her. So this is a good look at how much is in there. I may have taken out something if I've used it. I'm, I'm not quite sure. But let's go ahead and start right here. And, and notice the Oxford blood uh, suede inside. I love that color. Love that. And it's a pretty strong magnet, so you don't have to worry about it popping open unless you absolutely um, just overpack it, you know. And you don't want to do that with your bags anyway. So here we go. Right in the front, I have... 
a lot of receipts um, in this bag, I'm pretty sure. And then these are some of my credit cards. So of course, you know why I'm gonna lay those down. So that empties out this front pocket here. And then we're gonna go back and let's go, we'll just start right here closer. This is a young lady, my girlfriend found this um, nail salon when she was here. And I said I was going to check it out, and I have not because I haven't gotten back into um, wanting to be serviced by nail salons. But anyway, this is some more mail, so I'm just going to put that there. And then here are my iPod, uh, iPods. Aren't these so cute? Y'all know I love Dunkin' Donuts, but look at my iPods. I had to switch it up. <laughs> and it has got, listen, it was like stark white when I got it. And you see it's kind of on the, it's, it's looking like cream and, and coffee right now. It's a little dingy, but I'm going to wipe that down. But I love it. And it just flips open so freaking easily, you know. And it has the little hook there. So those are super, super cute. I love it. Okay, and next I had, because I was at a fair, I took my portable fan this is super cute. I absolutely love, uh-oh. I absolutely love this uh, fan. I have to lay this here for just a moment. This fan is so cute. You just pull it out and then the button is over to the side. I got my daughter one uh, for her birthday in July and she loved it. I was like, girl, it'd be hot. And she's always somewhere online waiting to get in. But it is so nice and it does have a different setting. So listen see how it went up and you definitely definitely feel that breeze it also comes with a usb um cord and there's the next one so it's three settings and i wish you could see how it's blowing like you see that so yes you get a good blow there okay so get you one don't get caught without this even though the weather is about to change but some of you guys are in the south for real for real like down florida way or out um well texas gets cold as well but wherever you are where you know it doesn't really get that cold girl invest 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 okay it looks like a little chanel bottle or liquor bottle whatever you want to call it but it's super super cute it's not all that big it doesn't take up a i rather take up the space with this and be cool when i'm standing on line and stuff like that than to not have it and just keep it charged it holds charge very well but i'd be like Girl, I'm so cool, 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 cool. Ain't nobody bad like me. Sing it. C-O-O-L. What's that spell? Cool. <laughs> Let me stop. Oh, God, that's so funny. Anyway, I don't know why that came from. I had a cousin that he would get on the piano playing that song. So it sticks with me sometimes. I'm sorry, guys. It's just, but anyway, moving right along. Okay, so let me go ahead and jump in here. So here we are, and we are going to pull out, right here is my Kabuki brush. So y'all know I always put some powder on this and um, keep my face, try to keep the shine off, especially when it's hot outside. This is my Butter Gloss by NYX. I love this. That's what I have on now with a little bit of brown liner, but I like how neutral it is. This is the wallet that I'm carrying with it. And of course, there you go, they match. Gold and gold, I love that. Okay. Oh shoot, wait a minute, hold up, wait a minute. Can't be putting out no ID. But yeah, you all have seen this in another video. If you haven't, just go through my purse videos, okay? And next I have one of my little clear pouches. I have a set of three of these. They are trimmed in gold. They also come in uh, silver, okay? And I love Kiss Lock wallets. I absolutely love them. Like, I've seen them long, and um, I was so crazy to let someone have one, and I have not gotten that wallet back and, you know, able to find one like it, but I absolutely love it. And I was watching, I believe her name is Dazzle77. She loves Kiss Lock. And I like the um, the Dooney and Burke. So 
there was a particular one that I love that she had was a blue, I want to say. Shout out to you, girl. Um, I love her videos. I love her channel as well. So, um, yeah. So here I just keep my gift cards. And I have a pair of tweezers because I'm back with these medium length nails and trying to get my gas. I don't have time for it, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, more receipts, Dollar Tree, uh, Marshalls, Burlton, all that good jazz. And then I have another lippy in here. This is for when I'm wearing my, um, my mask because it is a liquid, you know, it's matte. Okay. Next I have some crazy glue. This is my favorite glue for my nails. If I don't put my nails on, with dip powder this is what i use i do not use that glue that come with the nails they just it just does not work for me and then next i have some cash these are yeah i just need to make a bank run but that's what that is and lastly is my atomizer and this is what i keep um various perfumes in they come in different colors uh i do have gold and pink and let me see what's in this one. I love this when you're out and about. You can't take everything with you. And if you start smelling like outside, oh, did I use all of you? Or did I? It was just the one. Yeah. Hmm. It smells like my Sam Sarah by Gerlin. I believe that's what that is. Yeah. And guess what? She is all empty. So she holds a lot. And what I generally will do. When I have suede bags like that, I will take me a, just a wet wipe, baby wipe, wet wipe, whatever. Let me grab it. Try not to shake the heck off the table for you guys. And just um, lightly cleanse your bag. So if you look in there, you'll see maybe just a little bit of lint. I don't like to see any of that. When I store my bag, so I go through and I wipe my bottom out. And that's why I always, you know, never really have a problem selling my bags unless people just trying to low, you know, low ball you. But you see that? Just get everything out of there. I really don't let my bags get dirty, but I always wipe them out. And then also go on the inside of this pocket or top pocket if you have anything, which I don't. But I'm going to go ahead and wipe anyway. And yeah, I just, that's all I do. And then I notice people's bags get sticky here, especially Louis Vuitton. They, you know, for them to be high end, but this ain't about them. But anyway, yeah, wipe your bag. Make sure you don't get anything, any gulk and stuff. And that's how your bags should look. Don't store your bags nasty. Keep them up just in case you want to put them on a the resale market. Guys, thanks for hanging out with me and doing this crossbody with me. What's my bag? And checking out how I personalized it. I absolutely love this. And I will have more uh, what's in my bags coming up. The next one that I'm going to do is supposed to be a live one. I have to figure out exactly how to do it. Um, with I want to be able to like read you guys' comments on my iPad. And I guess film it on my phone. I don't know which one is easier. Or I could just do it on here. I just hate when people do their live and they're like this. Trying to see, you know, the comments. So I feel like if you have two devices, you'll be able to do a little bit better, you know. So anyhow, let me know what you think about my bag. Let me try to get a thumbnail because I don't like what YouTube, I don't like what you be choosing for me. I don't. I don't like if I'm like, that's the one you choose, okay? You just, they just pick some random junk. It's like, God, is anybody looking? I, I'm sure it's just the machine doing it. Okay, so here we go. And I don't know, hold on, let's put it back in there. Let's get it together, let's get it together. These are so fun, I love doing this. And I'm gonna bring you guys more, I think I'm just gonna predominantly do what's in my bags. I'm not gonna shop with y'all no more. I'm not gonna bring you guys any clothes. Cause it seems like, According to my analytics and what I'll be looking at, which I said in another video that just has not come out yet because uh, it's stuck in my damn phone. Um, you guys seen to, my highest videos are what's in my bag videos. You watch those all day long, all the time, sometimes multiple times. So therefore, comment below and tell me if I'm wrong, but that's just how I feel. That's what I'm going off of. That's what I see. So if that's what you guys want, hey, 
I'm fine by that too because I love, I absolutely love bags. But let's see if we could get a thumbnail. <laughs> Don't forget the nails, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, thank you. It's been real. I will see you guys on my very next What's in My Bag video or my bag of the month. Please comment below if you plan on joining. I am going to try to do it live on a Sunday. I'm not going to do it this Sunday because I know that um, hubby will be going out of town. So I want to spend some time with him. So therefore, maybe next Sunday or maybe during the week. Tell me what day you guys are bored during during the week. Because you guys know I'm a stay-at-home stay wife and mom. So, therefore, I can do whatever day or week or night. Even if we want to do evening and do a little wine. You guys know your girl into a little bit of wine now. And stuff like that. <laughs> oh, God. I finally found one little wine that I like. And I'm just like, I think I'm a wine drinker now. And got me a little set of glasses and everything. But, hey. I'm not a drinker. All right, guys. Anyway, thanks for hanging out, checking this bag out. I will get the proper name. At the time, like I said, it was called the Jade. I think the Small Jade. When I see something similar now, that's not what they're calling it. But thanks for watching the video. Let me know what you think about the designs and, you know, how I personalized it. You know, you can always put some other chains and some poof. I just didn't want any, like, poofy balls. Like, I've been trying to stay away from that. So that's why I did this. And, um, yeah, you can also put a little something on your tab here, which I normally do. But because I don't use this a lot. You know what? We didn't even go back here, though. Look at me ending the video. Bonus clip. Wow. Well, I'll be darned. We do have stuff back here. <laughs> okay. What do we have back here? So we have a pin, which is a no-no. Don't put no pins in your bag. We have, okay, insurance, or that's registration. We have a credit card. We have some dollars, a couple dollars. And we have those new wipes that I called. And I do like them. I like these better than the other ones that I normally use. And we have a ticket from what I went to the fair. And that's it. We have nothing else. We have nothing else. Be better to yourself tomorrow than you are today. And again, you guys know it's never goodbye. See you later. Subscribe.